Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking about the Lollipop baby monitor. Now I've been looking for a baby monitor for a very very long time. I think I've watched hundreds of reviews on which baby monitor to get. I came across this on Fathercraft YouTube channel and he did a really good review about all the um, smart HD high quality um, top baby monitors and basically this was a middle um, camera it's just great for the price the top um, tier baby monitors were just too expensive for me um, and some of them were US based so um, I went for the lollipop baby camera and this is the reason why. Okay, so firstly, um, this is the lovely box that it comes in. Now I got it in turquoise blue, as you can see the color down here. I'm pretty sure that um, depending on the color of your monitor, that strip would change. So it's absolutely lovely packaging. Uh, it does come in three colors in total. so. It's the turquoise blue that I've got, um, cotton candy pink and a sort of lime greeny colour that they call pistachio. So um, they're your choices. And when you open it up, you have um, your camera in here like this. Um, it is so cute looking. Um, it's a little bit bendy because I have already been playing with it. Um, and the reason for that, it's a high quality um, silicon material that bends, as you can see that I'm doing here, bends in all different ways. And this is to help mount it um, onto anything that you like. So for example, um, one of the options is this, um, tree branch that goes um, um onto the wall it mounts onto the wall and you can basically wrap the um monitor around the branch like that um or you can simply bend it like so and there is a little clip that just clips those two together. The third and final way, although I'm sure you can find plenty of other ways actually, but this is the one they advertise. So just with a bend, you can do like a sort of, create your own stand for it, like that. And it basically just sits on a surface like so. Um, but it will fit in anywhere. It's such a beautiful design. I just um, bend it around the corner of my bedside cot. Um, I literally just bend it like that um, and I actually just sort of wrap it around like that so it's nice and secure. I also absolutely adore in their packaging that even just what the cables come in, they have these adorable little baby feet. <laughs> they are so cute. It also comes in the box of all the different ways of how to um, how to assemble it. It does operate on Wi-Fi, um, but it needs to be connected to a plug. That's my only problem is that you have a cable running everywhere. Um, it's fine for now because we just run it onto the carpet and up the side of the cot where um, it doesn't go into the cot at all. But obviously as he gets older and um, Jack starts running around, you know, climbing out of his cot, I don't know what he's going to be like. You know, the cable is quite concerning. I actually just discovered that there is this that sticks along the wall that holds the wire in. So this runs. So there's a few of these that you put together and it holds the wire in place so you don't have to worry about cables. The setup was actually really straightforward, super easy. It's all controlled um, via an app, um, which is suitable for iOS, Android, that sort of thing. It gives you the instructions on the app. Like I said, super simple, really quick. Now, when it was all connected, 
we had a lot of network connection issues and now our Wi-Fi is very, very good. You can have um, in the house connection, um, out of the house connection, that sort of thing. Um, so if you're out of the house, you, someone that's not in the house, say your partner's at work, they can also view um, through the camera as well on their app, um, which is amazing if Tom's at work and you know, he just wants to see what's going on and if it's on, um, which I do, actually I turn it off and on. Um, just by unplugging it and plugging it back in and it, it just picks up straight away once you set it up. You don't have to redo this if you unplug it. Now that's just me being a security freak. I have heard of plenty of people's baby monitors being hacked and this is such a scary thought. So as soon as we're um, in bed as well, uh, next to Jax, I just turn it off. Obviously when he goes into his own room, the camera will be on constant throughout the night. Um, so that's just something to be aware of. But as I was saying about the connection issues, it was basically saying that it wasn't connected inside the house, it was connected outside the house. In the end, Lollipop actually fixed the problem for me specifically and that just required updating the app and it worked absolutely perfectly since then. So huge thank you to Rollipop customer service. Um, so if you do get any connection issues, I mean, a lot of the reviews do complain about connection issues and some people say, oh, that's because you've got bad Wi-Fi and all the rest of it. But actually I knew I had great Wi-Fi in my house and it's only a small house. So it's not like the range was any problem. But um, just contact them, be persistent and, you know, I like to think that they would help you as much as they helped me because I love this baby monitor. So this baby monitor is high definition. The quality is absolutely next level. Now, because you're using um, your smartphone, the quality on there is amazing compared to a lot of standalone um, baby monitors um, with the little handheld devices. Um, some of those quality on those are just terrible and I really wanted a, a high quality image. Now, it has the infrared night um, vision as well. It does not glow. A lot of baby monitors has like a red glow uh, around it so it can see the baby and some people complain about that. And this does not have it, which is ideal. You wouldn't believe that how much it can see with no light on at all. It goes to a really nice white dreamy look um, and it is amazing. You can see your baby breathing. It is that good. You can't move inside the app. So you can't, you know, like pan and tilt and move the camera. It is just where it is however you can zoom um which is really good actually because when Jax is sleeping and he is really really still I just have a little zoom in on his chest and I can just see him breathing which is just really just it's a really comforting feeling so other cool features that the lollipop has is that it has a two-way talk um so if I'm downstairs Jax is upstairs and needs some soothing. Um, I can talk to him through the monitor. It has white noise like vacuums and hair dryers, all sorts of things um, that can play out of it as well. It also has um, a cry detection and it'll send you a notification to say um, your baby is crying and there's another one that's like your baby is crying um, really loud or something like that so there's two of them the other one is it notifies you um, about cross detection so you can create your own little um, cross detection box around your baby so um, if your baby moves outside the box it'll notify you so that's really good if you've got um, you know a little toddler that's crawling out of his bed um, and you can put it around you can put the little box around his bed as soon as he's out you get a notification pretty sure you'll hear the little footsteps upstairs but it's really good if you've got a big house it also gives you notifications for any noise so you can set the noise level um, via decibels um, so 
this takes a bit of trial and error because I didn't know how loud it would pick up on things. Um, so we've got it at a really good level now where if he makes a loud noise that's enough that we want to be notified, it does. But if he just um, is stirring or making little noises, then we don't need to be notified. Now, it is um, completely live view, but it does store um, memory as well. So you can look back on the night um, when there's a cross detection or a notification, it saves like a little snippet of the video. So you can see what time it was um, and that sort of stuff. So it's got quite good um, memory on it. And apparently there's a sleep log coming soon on their app as well, which is great, which is another reason why I absolutely love the um, the adaptability of, of having just the camera with the app because they're always um, updating it and it's just a simple quick update on your phone to get the new and improved app and it works perfectly alongside uh, the camera whereas you know other standard monitors that's just all you get. There's a separate sensor that you can get that monitors the temperature and humidity levels in the room that also connects to the app now i didn't go for this option i think it was oh, off the top of my head i think it was about 50 pounds extra um and it it's a plug that goes into um a plug socket obviously but we didn't go for this option because i already had the grow egg temperature um lamp that sits in our room so we can see the temperature anyway also um the you know being in the UK the humidity levels um, don't seem to be that much of a problem uh, I've never heard anyone talk about it but I suppose if you're in a different um, country with high humidity levels you might want to know this so that really covers everything to do with the lollipop baby cam I bought this on Amazon it retails for about 150 pounds which I think is really really good value um, I can't recommend it enough. I'm going to put a little screenshot of what the image looks like from the baby cam monitor. Um, I'll do a little um, video recording for you of it as well so you can see how the app works and see how amazing the quality is because that's what sold it for me. But this little cam has so many features and I absolutely adore it. For watching my video on the lollipop baby cam for more reviews please subscribe and follow me on instagram